Big Data Specialization on Coursera. This is the most popular course on big data that you can find on the platform today. There are over 100 students enrolled in it, and it has a general rating of 4.5 out of 5 stars. But is this the course series you should choose to learn big data? Hey folks, my name is Daniel, and today I am reviewing the big data specialization on Coursera. So things I am going to cover in this review are Course overview, structure and content, pricing and certification, career opportunities. Traditionally, we will look at some student reviews, and I will let you know what I personally think about this course series. Also, guys, make sure you check out all the useful links in the description after watching this video. There might be some nice discounts. And now let's get into it. Overview. All right. So what is this specialization program all about? Well, guys, with this course series, you will dive into the exciting world of data science, specifically big data. Here you will get hands-on experience with the tools and systems that big data scientists and engineers use daily. You will be guided through the fundamentals of working with Hadoop using MapReduce, Spark, Peak, and Hive. And don't worry if you are new to coding. You will be provided with code to follow along and learn from. As you progress, you will learn how to perform predictive modeling and harness the power of graphs, analytics to tackle complex problems. This course is designed to give you a solid understanding of what big data insights can offer and equip you with practical skills to work with it effectively. The course creators at the University of California, San Diego, promise that you will learn how to ask the right questions about data. What's more, you will get the necessary skills to communicate effectively with data scientists. Plus, you will acquire the knowledge to explore large and complex data sets on your own. And in the final capstone project, you will team up with data software company Splunk to put your newfound skills to the test by performing basic analysis of big data. This hands-on experience will give you the confidence to tackle real-world data, challenges and pave the way for a successful career in the field. By the end of this specialization, you will be well equipped to navigate the world of big data and make a meaningful impact in your professional journey. Prerequisites Another great thing about this course is that it's beginner-friendly. So, if you are a beginner in the world of data science, don't worry, guys. Because this course is designed specifically for you. You don't need any prior programming experience to get started. However, to make the most of the hands-on assignments, you should be comfortable installing applications and working with virtual machines. These skills will help you dive into the practical aspects of the data science and get the most out of this learning experience. Structure and content Guys, before we move on, I try to make educational content in an entertaining way, make it fun instead of boring. And in the return, I just ask to like this video and subscribe to my channel, if you enjoy the content I make. That's all. Alright, this specialization program is made up of six courses. Here they are – Introduction to Big Data. This course is designed for beginners who want to understand the core concepts and terminology behind big data, its challenges, applications and the systems that power it. You will also get an introduction to Hadoop, a popular framework that has made analyzing big data more accessible and manageable, big data modeling and management systems. In this course, you will learn why there has been an explosion of new big data platforms and how they help us manage and analyze vast amounts of data. Through hands-on tutorials, you will work with real-time and semi-structured data examples. You will get familiar with popular systems and tools like Asterix DB, HB Vertica, Impala, Neo4j, Redis, and Spark SQL. You will discover how to unlock invaluable insights from untapped data sources and even find new ones. Big Data Integration and Processing In this course, you will retrieve data from databases and big data systems, understand the connection between data management and big data processing patterns, identify when big data problems require data integration, perform big data integration and processing using Hadoop and Spark, machine learning with big data. In this course, you will learn how to harness the power of machine learning techniques to dig into your data, analyze it and make the most of it. You will be introduced to a range of tools and algorithms that you can use to build your own machine learning models. These models can learn from your data and even tackle big data challenges by scaling up to meet your needs. Graph Analytics for Big Data 
In this course, you will discover new ways to work with graph structure data, including modeling, storage, retrieval and analysis techniques. By the end of this course, you will have the know-how to transform your data into a graph database and efficiently perform analytical tasks at scale. Best of all, you will be able to apply these skills to your own projects, revealing valuable insights from your datasets. Big Data Capstone Project And in this exciting final project, you will be using the tools and methods you will learn throughout this specialization to create your own big data ecosystem. And folks, here is something interesting about it. This Capstone project is designed in collaboration with Splunk Company. This is a software company with a focus on analyzing machine-generated big data. Top performers will have the opportunity to present their work to Splunk and network with recruiters and engineering leaders. By impressing the professionals at Splunk with your skills and creativity, you could open doors to exciting new career opportunities or collaborations. And guys, that sounds pretty cool to me. Price and certification value. Alright, let's answer the big question. How much does this course cost? Well, folks, it's not free. And honestly, offering it for free would be kind of strange. To sign up, you will need a Coursera subscription. The good news is that it's part of Coursera Plus. So, when you pay for this certification, you also get access to many other courses for free. And guys, I totally understand, months of subscription sounds like a lot. But based on some feedback, I have seen some people finish it much faster. Plus, it's definitely more affordable compared to the cost of a college degree. Now, let's talk about certification. When you successfully complete the entire certification program, you will also get a career certificate. And it can be a nice addition to your LinkedIn profile or your resume. But folks, let me be straight with you. In my opinion, the practical skills and knowledge you gain here are more valuable than the certificate itself. Based on my experience, employers are often more impressed by your professional knowledge and skills than the certificates you hold. Career opportunities You know, guys, my subscribers often ask me, Daniel, will this course help me land a job? Well, the short answer is yes, it can. Because this learning program is crafted to arm you with all the skills you need for an entry-level job. That's why it throws in hands-on projects with real-world tasks. And it's all about preparing you for a job market. But, my friends, let's be real. Is it a golden ticket to a guaranteed career opportunity? No, I don't think so. Because you may want to keep improving those skills and actively preparing for interviews to get the job. Long story short, your success in job hunting is mostly about your own effort, with skills you have and not just online certification. Student reviews Ok, folks, time to look at some student reviews. Well, I can say that the majority of reviews for this course are pretty positive. The majority of students know that this course series is well structured and all the complex concepts are well explained. Here is one of the positive reviews I found, for example. Very simple, but a very informative specialization. This is an excellent introduction. You will need to study some topics like machine learning further to get a better understanding. If this was to be extended to a 10-course specialization, I would love to see more on model selection, model interpretation, regression and regularized regression, error analysis and inferential statistics model assembling and free text analysis. So, folks, keep that in mind. Is big data specialization worth it? Alright, so let me answer the most important question. Should you invest your time and money in this specialization? And I would say, if you need a pretty simple introduction into big data, this course might be great for you. I think it's a perfect starting point for those who want a straightforward introduction to the world of big data. So, with some effort, you can complete this specialization and gain a solid foundation in the field. Alright, my fellow developers, and that's all about my big data specialization review. Feel free to check out the course-related links in the description below, you might find some discounts there. As usual, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, until next time!